what's a human doing here? There hasn't been a human here in ages. They look like they're passed out. Let me just pick them up without trying to wake them up. Like, so. Oops, almost dropped them. Well, off we go. Now, let's get them to the house. And maybe I can get my friends to come over and see what's going on. A human here in Odyssey. It's crazy. We haven't seen them in ages. But I don't like the meaning. Boy, a human is here. After what the Queen of Hybrids did to protect us, there's a reason why we haven't seen them. I gotta let the others know. I need to let them know. Because that means the demon king's coming back. We have to prepare for that. Alright, we're at my house. No, well, it's fine. I always have an issue sleeping anyways. Um, so, what's up for you to calling this late? I found someone. Or, yeah, someone. Oh? Who is it? Uh, you might want to come over here to see for yourself. Because this someone is not from our world. Wait, 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 what do you mean, not from our world? You mean, they're from the human world? Yes, it seems that way. Okay, I'm on my way. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Oh, good, you're awake. I'm sorry, please, you need to rest. I found you passed out, outside. Um, my name is Catherine. I'm a dream witch. I go into people's dreams, take the dreams, turn it into pure magic, and help them with the other stuff. But, um, I don't want you to get up. You look dehydrated, so all you need to do is rest right now. But, but first, before, um, you do that, I need to know, do you remember anything of your past, or how you got here before you passed out? You- I got here as fast as I could. Where is the- Human. Uh, Catherine, can I talk to you in the other room, please? Um, sure. Hold on one second, Neko. I'll be right with you. I'm sorry. Um, I'll be in the other room if you need me. I honestly thought you were joking. Catherine, what is a human doing in your room, in your bed? I told you, I found them while they were passed out. They looked dehydrated, so I had to help them. Catherine, you know you can't help everybody you think is helpless. They were going to die if I didn't do anything. Plus, what if this is the person you've been waiting for? What if this is our chance to bring back the Queen of Hybrids? There's no way to bring her back, Catherine. Can't you see? The Demon King has already won. We're all gonna die. With that sheet that the Queen of Hybrids put up all those years ago, when it comes down, the worlds will merge. We're all gonna die. That's why I called you over here. Because, Neko, you're the smartest person I know. You can do anything. But over the years, you lost your faith. Why is that, Neko? You used to be so strong, so happy, because you believed that you were the chosen one. What changed? I mean, you're older, that's for one, but what changed? I saw the world for what it really is. People are just greedy, selfish, non-caring. They killed the human I was protecting in the human world. I lost Casey. They pushed him past the point, can't you see that? Now I don't know where he is. God knows what I can do. God, oh I don't know what to do. 
I all I can say is we have to protect this human, but what if we can't? What if the Demon King comes back? That I cannot do. No matter how strong you think I am, Catherine, I'm just as weak as you. Everyone thinks I'm this some magical, fantastic beast that doesn't care about who they hurt. But I do. I just can't help how strong I am. I can't help how the magic is in me that is super strong. I'm weak like you. Uh, uh, Catherine, I didn't- No, it's fine, Mako. You're frustrated. I understand. And you're right. I am weak. I'm just a low-level witch. But hey, at least I have the kind of part that will actually help people. Unlike you. Now, leave if you're not going to help us. Because I thought I knew you. But you're not a warrior. Catherine, what I'm trying to say... I don't want you to get hurt. <sighs> Whatever, Neko. I'm gonna go check up on the human. We've been in here for a while now. Um, you're welcome to stay if you want. Catherine, I'm... Bye! I'm going to check up with Miura now. Alright, sorry about that. Neko's just confused. Um... So, about how you got here, do you remember anything else while I was talking to Neko? You don't. Okay. Do you have any questions? Hmm? What is Neko? Uh, that's kind of hard to explain. I think I can explain my own race. Thank you very much, Catherine. I didn't know you followed me back into my room, Neko. Yes, go ahead, if you want to explain to the human. Well, human, it's funny you may ask Catherine what race I am. I am a hybrid. I am the reincarnation of the Queen of Hybrids. I am between a fox, wolf, demon, cat, and angel. And Catherine here, believe it or not, is the only human in this world. Well, I'm not really a human, Neko. I'm between a human, but I'm not human. Everyone here looks human, but we're not all human. I know you're not fully human, Catherine, but I'm just saying. So the human has someone- wait. Why are we even still calling them human? Don't they have a name? Uh, <laughs> I didn't really ask them that yet, Neko. Um, uh, human, uh, what should we call you? Uh-huh. You don't remember your name. You don't remember anything. Oh, no. No, 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 no. This isn't good. Why are you freaking out, Catherine? We can call him whatever we want. Isn't that right? Yes, but I'm talking about the memories. The human's memories were the only way we could get them back. Without the memories, we won't be able to unlock the portal. Whatever they did to come here. <sighs> hey, just cheer up. We'll figure something out. <laughs> All right. Let's just come up with names for them. Uh, sorry, Catherine. I can't help you. I left my brother in charge. Which one? Which one do you think? Haru? Yep. Oh, he is your older brother, though, so he should be more responsible. Anyways, I'll let you go. Bye, Neko. Thank you for helping me with the human. Uh, I didn't really do anything, but... You're welcome, I guess. See you later. <laughs> okay, what name should I call you? Hmm. I know! Dandelion! Do you not like that nickname? You think I'm insulting you by calling you Dandelion? Why? Oh, that's one difference between your world and our world. Um, your world, a dandelion might be a weed, but in my world, it's a beautiful flower. It, it was actually a compliment, because, <laughs> I mean, you are not bad looking. You're actually more beautiful than the fire tree. <laughs> Nothing, nothing, nothing. Um, 
Yes, Dandelion. That's what I'm going to call you. You're my Dandelion from now on. Uh, no, 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 I said that wrong. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> huh? You want me? What? You want me? Uh, no, 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 no. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Sorry if I started seeming acting strange. I have anxiety. It's something I'm not really proud of. I can't help that I get all nervous when I'm talking to people. I just don't see a lot of people, you know? It's really late, though. You should try to get some sleep. If you want, I could sing you a lullaby or use a spell to put you to sleep. <laughs> huh? You want me to sing you a lullaby? Uh oh, okay. Um, one second. Alright, um. So, the lullaby I'm going to be singing is actually a spell. It'll help you sleep better, I promise. And it'll also help me get my magic restored, because it converts streams to magic. So, if you don't understand the language, it's an ancient elven language. But if you don't understand it, <laughs> that's why. Because humans haven't seen elves in ages, I thought the language is dead by now. So, I'm going to sing it. A lullaby, yeah. <laughs>